If someone would ask me what's the best coffee in the Philippines, peso per peso, I think 7-Eleven coffee is one of the best coffee, peso per peso. Okay, today is August 30. Apparently, it's a holiday. Specifically, it's National Heroes Day. We're not going to talk about history here. What I'm just trying to say is that I don't have anything to do in the morning since it's a holiday in Wolan Trading. So today, I'm here in Nalabang and we're going to take some photos. There are two main reasons why I wanted to take photos today. Number one is that I just wanted a change of pace because ever since we had that third lockdown, parang I haven't done anything creatively and feeling ko pumupurul na yung utak ko. And yun, uh, I just wanted to do something new again or try something creative. Tapos, um, I remember back in 2016 or 2017 when I was starting out to, to learn how to use a camera and starting out to learn photography. And para sa kasi it's a stress reliever. Plus, I, I go outside with my friends uh, to shoot some photos. What's up, fam? Tapos ngayon, di ba parang, it, I guess I just have to do it alone. This is number two. This one's a bit funny kasi this is because I, I was watching an anime. And sobrang underrated ng anime na yun. Even me, I, could, I couldn't remember yung name ng anime yun. So, basahin ko yung name ng anime. It was Irodoku, The World in Colors. So, basically kasi, yung, yung story lang nun is that yung friend group ng anime na yun, uh, they joined a photography club. So, alam mo yun, parang sobrang ganda kasi yung, yung art style ng anime na yun. Even yung, uh, yung mga basic photography techniques like leading lines, like symmetry, like yung rule of thirds makita mo dun sa anime na yun. So, alam mo yun, parang watching it, it inspires me to take some photos again. So, basically, yun lang idea behind why I wanted to shoot photos today. Whenever I think of Palabang, specifically in Philin Best, it reminds me of nature inside a city. Because among all the business districts that I've been to, it has the most space and trees inside it. During the holiday that I went in, obviously there were very few people outside, which makes me scratch my head. Why are COVID cases getting higher and higher? I never really had a banger photo during that shoot, but I guess the most memorable moment for me was hanging out with this moody cat. Alright, I'm already back home. It's been a few days since the day that I shoot from the outside, from the time I'm recording this portion of this video. Shooting alone and shooting without any subject somehow makes me feel lost kasi diba, ano nga bang pipicturean ko? But at the same time, it allowed me to be spontaneous and find interesting subject along the way. God, I just really miss yung feeling of having a community. I remember back in 2017 or 2018, when your friends are actively collaborating with other people, lagi akong sumasama sa kanila kasi that allowed me to learn how to use a camera faster. Plus, at the same time, natutunan ko din how to communicate there sa mga model mo. Kasi, I remember back then, uh, yun nga, you're collaborating with other people and yung subject mo naman is tao din eh, ba? So, alam mo yun, parang doon ko na, na, na nalaman na um, 
communication is one of the most underrated skill na dapat meron isang photographer or, or videographer kasi totoo lang um, one of the final product it's either a video or a photo kasi di ba yung final product na yung one half comes from you know, the photographer or, or videographer and the other half comes from your subject or your model so dapat meron kayong synergy and magand- meron kayong magandang communication in order to properly make a good photo and video all right that's it for this video i hope you enjoy watching this simple video i eh, do also hope that you keep doing creative things that you are passionate about because it does really help you cope up with the recent things that's happening plus it's really good for your mental health so keep being creative and see you in the next video bye